Well, have you calmed down? Have you relaxed? Have you been able to process day one of the NFL draft? The fan base yesterday was quite entertaining, very similar to how I was after the Jamison Williams trade-up yesterday. Now, we, we're going to go into that a little bit more in another video, but this video here is going to be something we all saw coming. We knew the writing was on the wall, and once we, we drafted Jameer Gibbs 12th overall, we knew that this was probably going to happen sooner than later. What am I referring to? Well, the departure of DeAndre Swift. Coming from Jeremy Fowler, says sources, the Lions are receiving trade calls on running back DeAndre Swift, whose representatives have been in contact with the team about potentially moving to a new team. With Detroit drafting Jameer Gibbs, the talented Swift appears poised to leave Detroit. Now, you guys know how I feel about DeAndre Swift. I think we all feel the same way. Swift is has immeasurable talent, but that talent cannot be used if he's not on the field. And something that I saw last year that I don't think I saw the two years earlier is that while Swift was healthy and we know what he's capable of, his mindset continues to let him down. And here's what I mean by that. When we saw, when we watched Hard Knocks, we saw Deuce Staley. I mean, Deuce Staley went hard at him. We, and we saw that pay dividends when the season started. DeAndre Swift was a dog the first three games. He got hurt. I want to say it was game four in Minnesota. It was either, I think game four was, was the Seattle Seahawks, but game three was Minnesota. And I think that's when he got hurt. But he was actually like the betting favorite to win uh, rush, the, the rushing title. And this guy was a dog. He was actually trending to have the most yards in the league. Like he was the, I want to say the top running back those first two weeks. And we was like, here we go. But in the, in the back of our mind, we all always knew that DeAndre Swift had to remain healthy. And when he got tackled in that Minnesota game, I believe, and he was slow getting up, we was like, uh-oh. Then he wound up missing a few games. He was never the same after that. He came back and would be a dog and then would disappear again. And then we saw later in the season, I think it was particularly against the New York Jets, when he just he had the chance to break it upfield and he decides that you could see the timidness, you could see the shyness, you could see the indecisiveness when it comes to DeAndre Swift and his running style. And he had the, the brace thing on his shoulder and we find out that I guess he was never – he was never fully healed. And because of that, DeAndre Swift is most likely on his way out. Now, I think that that trade is going to happen today. Brad Holmes was able to move back up uh, and, and get some capital for the trade. So I think he, we it, it, and because of the trade and how it went down, we have no third anymore. 81 is now the Arizona Cardinals pick. So the Detroit Lions have pick 34, pick 48, pick 55. As of right now, we don't pick again until that fifth round pick later in the draft. So no third, no fourth. The end of day two, no draft. The beginning of day three, no draft, no pick. So what I think is going to happen, I don't think it's going to be player for player. I don't even think we're going to get a player out the deal. We could, but I think it's going to be a pick. Now, it is very possible out in, in some world, in some alternate timeline, that the Detroit Lions get two picks or more for DeAndre Swift. They wouldn't be high. One of them would be mid-round, and then the other one would be late round. Maybe maybe a, I mean, a third would be reaching at this point. I would love that because we don't have one. A fourth would be ideal. I could see maybe, maybe a... Uh, a fourth is what they're probably going for, but maybe like a fourth and two six or something like that. That's a lot. That is a lot on a guy for a guy with an expiring contract. But it really depends on how much faith and what do you think the next team thinks of him. And I think they could see what we all see, which is the potential for talent. And it would be a risk they would be willing to take if they were to see if they could pull that talent out of DeAndre. And maybe he wants to stay. Maybe because he could go here, he could be traded, have a full off season, and be a dog. And you know what? I would I would love to see that. I mean, because we all know what this kid can do. 
but he can't do it if he he can't stay on the field. And maybe, just like Jeff Okuda, a change of scenery is what DeAndre Swift needs. Sometimes he get that trade, maybe get a little chip on his back, being you know the second round pick and and getting traded away with his uh, draft brother Jeff Okuda. Maybe that'll be the spark, you know that that sparks DeAndre Swift to, I don't know, become the running back that he wants to be in the National Football League. So. I think that DeAndre Swift gets moved today. It's already in the works. It's just a matter of when and where. Uh, I think it happens tonight during the NFL draft, and we will add more draft capital to the roster. And DeAndre, we have seen our last game. I think we've seen DeAndre Swift last game as a Detroit Lion. But let me know what you think in the comments below. I think the writing's on the wall. It was on there before that. And when we took, we don't. You don't take a running back in the first round, and you're going to stick with the guy that has potential. That's all I got to say. Let me know what you think in the comments below. You guys are awesome. We had a ph phenomenal live stream last night. We did numbers. We, we broke records all on this channel. We had a great time, and we're going to continue that tonight. At probably 6 o'clock, we're going to get on and start talking about the NFL draft. So consider subscribing. We're almost at 10K. We have less than a 200 to get to 10K Y'all can help me do that. So you guys are awesome. Take care of yourself. And as always, go Lions. Take care of yourself and each other.